Welcome to the 2019 LACC Foundation Gala. Our red carpet featured distinguished alumni, celebrities, LACC dignitaries, donors, and honorees who attended this year's event. The 2019 LACC Gala was the biggest foundation fundraiser of the year. The gala featured a special live performance by the donors of the largest gift in LACC's history, Herb Alpert and Lonnie Hall. We'd like to uh, welcome all of you. It's a delight to be here for uh, LACC's 90th anniversary. It's pretty amazing. I know some of you are here to maybe donate, and I, it, it's, it's a great cause. I, I, really, I truly believe it. It really is helping people that would like a better shot at life. Yes, LA City College is 90 years old, but keep in mind, this is LA, so on camera it plays about 42. And we're launching a decade where we intend to grow our enrollment, to grow our capacity, and to grow our foundation. So I feel like I'm the luckiest person on the planet every morning when I walk onto the campus to a beautiful large banner displayed on our large student services building that says, Believe, achieve, succeed. I don't know what my life would have been like if I had not gone to Los Angeles City College. For $6.50 a semester, LA City College gave me more than I ever dreamed I could have. So since our last gala, we've increased our endowment by $3.8 million while awarding $4.75 million to almost 4,000 students and through assistance to college departments and programs across the campus. Our only goal, our every action, is designed to help the 18,000 students on our campus, which is the most diverse of any campus in the nation. Their desire to succeed is palpable. Their stories are incredibly compelling, many of them involving sacrifice, facing challenges, and inspiring tales of success. So let's listen to three of them right now. James Ingram represented LACC's students in need. I struggled to pay for the basics. I knew I needed help. I applied for scholarships and textbook vouchers from the LACC Foundation. It has not been easy. I still struggle. And I know that many students struggle more than I do. I am proud to serve as LACC's Associated Student Government President. <laughs> Preparing to graduate with associate degrees in modern political studies, liberal arts, and arts and humanities. And an offer of a full-time job from the mayor's office. Daniela Elizarez spoke as a second-generation immigrant and a dreamer. The balance of school, work, and caring for my disabled mother have been difficult. However, difficulties will never stop me from achieving my goals. I want our leaders to fully understand there are so many students willing to work and study hard, but need help with the basic, basics to survive. The LACC Foundation makes all that possible, and I'm honored to be able to thank you in person. Trust me, I will make you proud. From her birthplace in the war-torn African Congo to several foster homes in the Midwest, Maggie Bushiri found her voice and purpose at LACC. And when I finally went to LACC, a counselor led me to Garden Scholar, the best program ever. <laughs> the program helps students who are foster youth transitioning from a care program to independent uh, young adulthood. I have tutors. They help me with my writing. They taught me how to focus on my goals. 
Thanks to the LACC Foundation and the Garden Scholar Program, I will graduate this spring with an AA in Social Behavior Science and transferable unit towards a BA degree in Television Production and Broadcasting. On your table is a pledge card. Please fill it out. No amount too large, too small. Last year, there was about $43 billion given to higher education by donors like yourselves. Of that $43 billion, less than 2% was given to community colleges. 50% of the workforce in this country went to community college, and yet less than 2% of the money goes to community colleges. And you know that your gift is going to change lives for the better. Our live auction included a unique package from one of our most famous supporters. Hi everybody, I'm Jay Leno and we're here tonight to help Los Angeles City College. We do something here, this is called Jay Leno's Garage, it's my garage, we got about 188 cars, a bunch of motorcycles, steam engines, whatever, it's not open to the public, uh, you can get a tour of the garage. So make a donation, come tour the garage, and uh, I, I think you'll like it, you'll know it's all going for a good cause. Thank you. The auction of Jay Leno's Garage and three other exclusive packages raised over $20,000 for the foundation. It was the USC coach Rod Dato who introduced me to Los Angeles City College and to their baseball coach Bob Zuber. He sold me so hard on coming to, to school here. I thought I was going to UCMV. That's University of California at Melrose in Vermont. <laughs> the students at LACC were there to get an education. Not because they had to, because they wanted to be there. The final event of the evening was the presentation of the Rodney Respect Award. Comedy is such a magical thing. It is truly an art form worthy of study and respect, which is why I'm so pleased we founded the Rodney Dangerfield Institute at LACC. And I'm thrilled Jamie Masada, owner of the world famous Laugh Factory, <laughs> is receiving the Respect Award tonight to present the award to Jamie. Comedy's queen, Tiffany Haddish. And as I got older, as I got older, and Jamie became like basically, Jamie's like my dad. Uh, and I love you, Jamie. And you have helped me become a grown-up woman. Thank you, Jamie. Thank you for doing what you do. And I'm so honored to be able to present you with the Rodney Dangerfield uh, LACC Respect Award. Oh, thank you very much. I hope it's gold, is it? I think it's real. Is it? <laughs> All right, all right. Rodney, Rodney was m one of my heroes. I mean, uh, the first time I met him, he was with Sam Kennison. He came to the club, and uh, I never forget it. He said, put me up, and Rodney went on the stage. He did an amazing, amazing st standing innovation, made people laugh and crazy. The people, they went crazy to see uh, Rodney at the Laugh Factory. John Dangerfield, I love you. You're being wonderful. What you're doing, what you're doing for. Thank you very much. I cherish this award and thank you. Many thanks to all the sponsors, donors, and friends of the LACC Foundation. Hope to see you at the next LACC Foundation Gala.